Imagine the most important woman in your life dying from a cancer that is totally preventable. Yeah, it's had an impact on, on a lot of my life. My mother cried for me and she said, my daughter need to be saved. The worst day of my life. The second most common cancer. And we just keep on fighting, yeah. Lives are at stake. The question is, how is the world going to step up to meet that need? And we have to do something. We're going to travel the globe and discover how the world can rise up to the elimination of cervical cancer. We know what causes it, we know how to screen for it, we know how to treat for it. We have the weapon to prevent this from happening. We have a vaccine. We have used self-sampling. Cervical cancer is more prevalent in disadvantaged populations. We have to think multi-generational. Getting to the end game is a matter of political will. We cannot waste a second longer. Oh, stand beside me. The impact it has, but the family that you leave behind. Oh, stand your we have the tools. We call on governments to implement them with full commitment. And really encourage every country to adopt elimination targets. Nothing's gonna stop us it's so powerful. We are all moving toward this goal. Australia is on track to be the first country in the world to eliminate cervical cancer. This is a story about rising up, about how human ambition can overcome the seemingly impossible. We have the opportunity. It can be done. I'll be there to protect you. Right. Conquering cancer means a world with women who are empowered to give their full potential. Ooh.